health is absolutely important. One of the aspects is that we should all believe in the statement prevention is better than cure. It is our duty to take care of the health. It is an amana. It is a trust entrusted to us by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And it is wrong for us to allow ourselves to waste our health. Be it through a bad habit, be it through intoxicants, be it through just throwing ourselves at that which is harmful for us. All of that we need to take heed. We need to make sure if you have a bad habit that is going to affect your health, cut it out. Even the sleeping habits we have, it's our duty to ensure that we correct them, rectify them because definitely the sleep deficit affects the health in ways that you would not believe. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us goodness. My brothers and sisters, we are hearing of a virus and we know of it that has taken the globe by storm at this moment. This coronavirus, may Allah grant us cure, may He grant us protection, may He cure all those who are affected and may He make it a test and not a punishment. I mean, my brothers and sisters, we must make sure that we have done whatever is in our capacity to protect ourselves, to be able to immunize ourselves by the simplest method and that is prevention. Try your best. Make sure your surroundings are clean. Make sure what you touch is clean. Your hands are clean. Make sure you are in a clean environment. If need be, perhaps in certain countries, they would put on a mask in order to ensure that the air is somewhat filtered. All this is a duty that you have if push comes to shove. We are thankful in this country that we have not yet heard of any of such cases. But trust me, we are not immune to this. It can happen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala safeguard all of us. However, my brothers and sisters, whenever we are failing in health, we always seem to visit the doctor and we should and we must. And it's a duty to visit the doctor, to find out what's wrong with you. There will be diagnosis, there will be so many perhaps tests that they, the doctor might send you for. And you know what? People are always anxious as they await results, especially when they are not doing well at all. Very anxious. Do not remove Allah from that equation, my brothers and sisters. Remember, the doctors are there to help indeed, and we pray for them. But at the same time, if it's not for the help of Allah, Allah may decide not to show them exactly what's wrong with you. And yet the favor of Allah is that the diagnosis would be correct and the medication would also be correct. So we can never remove Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala from the equation. Always make a dua to Allah.